Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I just want to, uh, well, it's Monday Memorial Day, guys, and I want to wish uh, everyone a uh, happy Memorial Day, guys. Um, uh, to all the veterans, the people who have served in war, or who have just, you know, served their country by, you know, joining the army for three years and then getting out, like, so, you know, people who have been in war and people who haven't been in war, but they've been in the army. Uh, me, I, I've been in the United States Army, guys. I've been in the National Guard as well, okay? <clears throat> Way back, uh, you know, back in the 90s. <coughs> and, um, so I, I want to wish a happy, if anybody knows what it's like, the, the stresses and the strains of being a, a soldier, guys, in, in the military, uh, uh, it, it would be me. So if, if anybody would have um, uh, understanding of what it's like, it, um, it would be, be me, it would be, uh, I would be, you know, people like me are more able, even though I haven't been to war, are more able to sympathize with those who have seen war and have been killed in action. Uh, <clears throat> I, I'm lucky I haven't been in war, guys. Uh, you know, so sometimes being in the military is like war in itself, you know, because it's a rigid lifestyle, guys. It's, it's a rigid lifestyle. You're not, in, you're not living, when you're in the military, you're, you're, you're living in, 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 under a dictatorship. You're not living in a democracy, so you don't have, you know, the same types of freedoms. Uh, they say jump. You say how how high? You know, you know, jump how high? And um, and uh, I'm so thankful I never went, went over the war, got injured or, or killed. Um, you know, I am getting disability benefits now from the veterans office, and uh, much appreciation to the veterans office for helping me out because the state disability isn't helping me out. And um, I mean. I, I'll never have no idea what it's true or like to, to be in war. I, I, hope, I, I, I would never want to witness the horrors of war, guys. Um, <clears throat> and uh, so when people say, oh, happy Memorial Day, they, they say to me, I have people say, oh, thank you for your service. And, and I'm sure people say happy Memorial Day. You know, people, someone passed me on the street right now and they knew I was in the military. They say, oh, happy Memorial Day. But, but you know, guys, uh, the real thing still doesn't go to me, guys. Uh, yeah, like, it goes out to those who are actually in war, who are actually injured in war, killed in war, maimed in war, and, and, and witnessed the horrors of war. And, um, and, and not to mention that those who suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder, too. And, um, you know, and, uh, yeah, if anything, those veterans deserve more thanks and, and, and respect than, than I do. So, yeah, happy Memorial Days. And, and, and you know what, guys? It, it doesn't matter um, what part of the country you're from, whether you're from the East, <clears throat> West, you know, Pacific Northwest, Midwest, Southeast, Southwest, uh, I, you know. Thank you to all you guys, you know, all you, all you veterans, you know, and, um, <clears throat> and, uh, whether you're from a, a blue state like me or a red state, you know, thank you, much appreciated, and have a happy Memorial Day, guys, make the most of it, take care, bye-bye.